finds the most successful innovators. That they never, ever give up. The philosophy of a cockroach. You can step on me over and over again, but I will not die. Biggest reason that entrepreneurs fail. Because they lose their vision or their courage, and then it's over. Does Dean Kamen have any fear? The only thing I fear is running out of time. I'm obsessed with time. We can deal with any problem out there except time eventually will take us all. So I want to use every second, every minute, every hour, every day as efficiently as I can. Uh, favorite thing to collect? Knowledge, new ideas. I collect all sorts of old technology, but it isn't for the thing. It's for what the thing represents. When I look at old technology, it's not the technology that amazes me. It's understanding why did they build that? What problem were they trying to solve? Why did they use that technology to solve it? Oh, they didn't have computers or they didn't have modern. And when you look at old technology, you're really looking at a snapshot of the human condition at the time it was made. Where did they choose to put their effort? What problem were they trying to solve? What was important to them? And collecting these old technologies is really a way of understanding where we've come from and using it as a basis to understand where we should be going. Favorite junk food? Coffee, ice cream. What book are you reading right now? Math for the Afraid or something. And I'm trying to understand why some people don't see mathematics as beautiful and elegant like they see art or poetry. So I like to read books by people that think they've understood that problem so I can help translate their ideas into uh, opportunities to get more kids to love math and science. Who gets to Mars first, Elon Musk or Richard Branson? It's probably a dark horse that you haven't seen yet and I think the whole transformation of space is going to surprise everybody at, at every new turn. If you could be any animal, what animal would you choose? The one that lives the longest. If you could have any superpower, what superpower would you want? I'd want to be able to go up and back in time. In 10 years from now, one industry that won't exist anymore. I think you'll see industries that are dangerous and dirty and, and boring go away and be re replaced by industries in which people can be creative, they can have fun doing what they do, they can be sustainable and environmentally friendly, uh, and they can make the world a better place while they give people great careers. One person you got excited about when they started to follow you on Twitter? Every time I hear from any kid that's involved in FIRST who starts a conversation by saying something like, I got involved in FIRST and because of it, at that instant, that kid is my favorite kid.